the Nissel Granules. Hello and welcome. Today we will explore the fascinating world of Nissel Granules, their structure, function, and significance in neuronal biology. This presentation will take you through their composition, role in protein synthesis, and importance in both normal function and disease states. Let's get started. Introduction Nissel granules, also known as Nissel bodies, are essential for the function and survival of neurons. They were first discovered by Franz Nissel in the late 19th century and are crucial for protein synthesis. These granules are mainly composed of rough endoplasmic reticulum and ribosomes, making them the protein factories of neurons. Structure of Nissel granules Structurally, Nissel granules are found in the cytoplasm of neuronal cell bodies and dendrites. They consist of stacks of rough endoplasmic reticulum and ribosomes. Under a microscope, they appear as dark staining granules due to their RNA-rich composition. Importantly, they are absent in the axon and axon hillock, making them a distinguishing feature of neuron anatomy. Why are Nissel granules absent in axons? Nissel granules are absent in the axon because the axon is primarily responsible for conducting nerve impulses and lacks the necessary organelles, like rough endoplasmic reticulum, needed to synthesize proteins, which are the primary function of Nissel granules. Therefore, protein synthesis occurs solely within the cell body of a neuron where Nissel granules are located. Composition of Nissel granules Now let's break down their composition. Nissel granules consist of rough endoplasmic reticulum, provides a surface for protein synthesis, ribosomes, convert mRNA into proteins required for neuronal function, RNA and proteins, essential for neurotransmitter production and enzyme formation. Basic staining properties. Due to their high RNA content, they stain darkly with creasel violet and toluidine blue. Function of Nissel granules. They are primary sites of protein synthesis, producing structural proteins and enzymes. They help synthesize neurotransmitter-related proteins, essential for signal transmission. They play a key role in axon regeneration after injury by increasing protein production. Overall, they maintain neuronal health, growth, and synaptic function. Distribution of Nissel granules Nissel granules are densely packed within the cell body soma and dendrites, reflecting their high metabolic activity. However, they are completely absent in the axon and axon hillock. This distribution highlights their role in localized protein synthesis, supporting neuronal maintenance and repair. Role in Neurological Disorders Nissel granules are essential markers in neurological disorders. Chromatolysis, the dissolution of Nissel granules, following nerve injury, indicating neuronal stress. Neurodegenerative diseases, abnormalities in Nissel granules, are observed in Alzheimer's and Parkinson's diseases. Hypoxia and ischemia. A lack of oxygen can lead to their degradation, impairing neuronal survival and function. Staining techniques. To study Nissel granules, we use special staining techniques. Cressel violet staining, the most common method, highlighting Nissel bodies in neurons. Toluidine blue staining, a basic dye used for contrast in histological studies. Nissel staining helps differentiate neurons from glial cells and assess neuronal health. Clinical and research significance. 
Why are nissl granules important in research and medicine? They are neuropathological markers, helping diagnose nerve injuries and degenerative diseases. Their presence indicates neuronal viability and metabolic activity. Research on nissl granules is vital for developing neuroprotective therapies and nerve regeneration strategies. Conclusion Nissl granules are crucial for neuronal protein synthesis and function. Their presence and distribution reflect the metabolic activity of neurons. Studying them helps us gain deeper insights into neurological diseases and nerve repair mechanisms. That brings us to the end of our presentation. I hope you found this session insightful. Now I'd love to hear your thoughts or answer any questions you may have. Thank you for your time.